As we get back to work and back into the workplace, interacting with our coworkers, the key here for gentlemen is to remember that you have a lot of choices. And many of the employers, many of our large corporations are allowing us to be a little more casual, still keeping a professional image, but not having to wear a full suit, full dress shoes, and a full shirt and tie. So keep that in mind, mix and match the tops and bottoms, maybe wearing just the jacket alone with a separate pair of pants to keep the professional but soften it up by being a little more casual. Most importantly, when it comes to the nose for gentlemen, remember that you still need to wear a dress shoe. No sneakers, no sneakers, no sneakers. Now, you have to be mindful of your industry, but the key here is that your shoes will always elevate your image. Even when you're casual, when you're wearing a very nice shoe, it gives you a very nice professional image. Hi, thank you. You do not have to be the traditional full suit, the traditional skirt and pants, but you can be in a position where you can now switch your bottoms and your top and also wear colors that are dedicated to the season, specifically in the softer tones, softer pinks, softer blues, rather than the bold of those exact same colors because we're getting reacclimated and reacquainted with our coworkers and we don't want to shock and wow. We do want to wow, but not shock. I just think that especially going into a business meeting, it's so important to look pulled together. Mm -hmm. Incredibly classic and chic. And again, as we discussed earlier, kind of that throwing back to, you know, Catherine Hepburn. There is a degree of creativity. It's something that they can wear truly probably daytime, into evening, into a casual weekend. People are traveling, so again, they're spending a little bit more money these days. Also, they're buying something that the quality is there. That's why they shop in a small independent. They're looking to be put together. They're looking for a story. They're looking like, where did it come from? Where was it manufactured? Why are the fabrics important? Why is the silhouette important? Why is the factory that you're manufacturing in important. Okay, so here we've got a beautiful vintage piece of uh, clothing. From What do you think about this? 
uh, a bill of glass, vintage bill of glass, beautiful. Some of it is, you know, still zooming. We're still zooming. So um, what I think is nice to do is when you are on a Zoom call, it's important to sort of elevate your look and so you can be noticed a little bit more. To just wear a plain white shirt, um, something conservative, is not really going to hold someone's attention. So I think because of Zoom, people got a little bit more creative even though they had pajamas on the bottom.